<laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, okay, that was lucky that it didn't just slice my butt. It is gonna strangle him. Oh! Oh. So he's out of the trap. He's out of the game. Oh! Tom, fuck I'm, me. I was not ready. <laughs> I was not ready at all. Oh, oh my if, god. If it's that like had portal. Been... You're outside of the testing rooms. If that had been Xbox buttons. That's acid. Is it acid? That's acid. It... Now, yeah, take some pit. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ah, yes. Um. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that, sure. don't, that don't seem so good. You can inspect it. Just have a drink. Don't put your finger in. I didn't say put your finger in. Oh, yes, it's acid. Is there something floating around in it? What's, what's that? It's just reflect. I don't know. It's just something at the bottom. It's nothing. I suspect it to be like a bit of a body or something. Thing. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, see, we saw okay. this. Oh, God. I ah! So you're supposed to be in there? In the cage? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Look oh, at all look. Those. That's a 10. That's a 10. I don't. Like, they, they never. Oh. We are almost halfway to getting our gun. I'm going to be so happy to get that gun. Just blam, blam! Yeah. And the guy... Next time we see him. Belknap, or whoever. Uh, du du Dumont. I did say it might be the curator. What do you? What did you think I, of yeah, that Yeah, no, I, I was very on board <laughs> with the curator being the guy. Just because there's a dude in the mask, and I, I can't really think of any other characters that we've had. Similar oldie timey dress. Uh, and the bowler hat. Yeah. But is that too on the nose? Or is it a rewarding payoff? Who knows? Is that going to be locked? Well, I instantly hate that this is a mechanic. Uh, yeah, I think it's. I think it's fine. Also, just like looking around, there's like, there's some apparatus and shit. Yeah. I'm like a pretty big dude here. I'm. I think like, if you just jumped out and hit that guy as hard as you could with any number of the things in here, you could just take him out. Yeah. But that's assuming he's a human being. And not the man with the devil in him. Uh, yeah. Because when you have the devil in you, your stats just shoot up. Oh god, it's right? such a buff. Yeah. You got the strength and the constitution of at least two men. Yeah. Because you've got you and the devil in you. Massive devil cock as well. Yeah. Big like, old fucking swinging cock and balls. That thing just, just absolutely grows enormously. Paint thinner. But there's a little boxy box. 
with a little light. Oh, light. an actual torch. Uh, now... There's a rat. It's a rat. Rat, rat jump. Rat scare. <sighs> Too much of a fucking manlet to read. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Do I need to... F oh! Your pole. Completely forgot that was a mechanic. I did too. Now, this might make... What is that? Oh, it's that's why the... The mount matches. Perfect. Oh, please tell me it's not night vision. Okay, what does that even do for me? So if you use the camera, is there a different mode on it now? Or what's the point in that? There's L L what that just zooms in and out. There's no other buttons prompted to do anything. No. So it's just a better lens. It's a better lens than you, the professional videographer, have. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Unless this is where he wants you to go. Uh, oh god, it could still be traps, couldn't it? There's traps all the way down. Um, it's just a mannequin, right? Probably. That sounds like something was opening. Where? Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Oh, oh shit, the bed. Like right that <sighs> Okay. Just one for later. Yeah. One for the spank bank. <laughs> oh. Very <laughs> zoomed in on this. Seventy-two, ninety-three. Seven two nine three. Seventy two ninety-three. Oh god. Oh. Oh. It's the bomb. Zero zero two eight. Okay. Seventy two ninety-three. Zero zero two eight. Or double O twenty eight, fuck. Have I told you I don't really care for mannequins that much? Yeah, I don't think people generally do. It's 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 kind of a thing. It's the uncanny valley kind of thing. But they're almost oh fucking crap. Should I just start writing these down, Tom? Seventy two yeah, do it. So we got seventy-two ninety-eight. No, nine ninety-three. Uh, zero zero two eight. Uh, six eight eight three. Six eight eight three. Oh God. Oh. Ugh. Tom, please stop. I know it's not horrible. Got... Tom, Jesus fucking Christ, Tom. Why do you like this, Tom? There could be coins. I just kind of want to, like, just, like, put the fucking... <laughs> I can't see! 
Oh, what did they just open? I think. Are you ready? Yep. Woo! Let's turn the light on. Oh, it has a human ear. Oh, and teeth? Oh, real human teeth. Gross. So this is from the Chicago Killer, or whatever it was. Wow. No letters? Oh, no geez. letters. No numbers on that one, I guess. They're going to have to hide, aren't they? Where? Let's Fuck, go. I went the wrong way. Got plenty of time. Where are you hiding from? It's a man. I don't care for him. Like, I'm sure that dude's around here somewhere. He's not in his cell. I wonder if we had like just jumped out and like, Bleh! like if we could make him shit his pants. <laughs> Done. I guess when that vignette effect fades, you know it's okay. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, just jam it in his fucking eye. Okay. You can't take it, or and there's nothing on it. Right? That's about all the range of motion they have. It's just a... It's a drill bit. Right. That's... <gasps> oh my god. You've got a weapon. Seems crazy when there's so much other shit around here, but... <laughs> I'm into it. Mm. I've been very pro get a weapon for a long time. You should be taking pictures of like the body bits. Oh, you're right? completely right. I should have taken a photo of that fucking head. Oh, this is the worst place to take a photo, isn't it? Where's that head? But it was like face down and I put it back face down again. I mean, it is just a body. So that's pretty good. That's not a mannequin. That's an actual body. I don't know if I want to button. press that button. Because he's going to talk to me. Oh, hey there, buddy. How's it going? Mm. Yabbity do go. <laughs> That's not what I want. <laughs> Is that what they say? Yabbity do go. Oh, sweet oh. coins. More treasure. Five. Nice five. We're halfway to the gun. Halfway. Okay. Right. Well, first, yeah, you get a spear, and then the gun. You got to upgrade it to the gun. What if he gets the gun and just like duct tapes it to the end of his? Press the button. Press the button. Okay. Press it. Okay. Don't press the button. Press the button. Nah, you're all right, mate. Thanks for the offer, though. That's a dead body. That's not like a living man saying it. Needing help. Oh. Do you need some coats? Oh, these are the cameras. These are going to be the hidden cameras around the place on those things, right? Seventy-two ninety-three is one of them. Oh. The dining area. Oh. Okay. No records us poking the eye out. Which is what happened earlier. Uh, 0028. It's Charlie. Give them to me. Give me my okay, cigarettes. yeah, that was the, um, the, the bartender. Bar um, and 6883. It's me. Oh. You oh, the oh, home thing God. popped up. This fucking thing popped out of nowhere. Okay. So just try. So just try one at random. Uh, what? Like one, two, three, four. Feels like, like. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, maybe you're right. Are you actually gonna do it? Yeah. 
Ah, Ain't nothing okay. happens. I bet there is like a, alarm went off. a hidden one. Oh. 1989. Oh. Monday. Oh, the FBI investigator. Okay, the face is scribbled out. Mm. So is he? <laughs> He's going to be the dude, and he is the dark pictures guy. Um, Maybe not both. Inspector Mundy. Because... It doesn't matter if we know what Inspector Mundy looks like, right? We've never heard Unless his voice we know who they are. Him. Yeah. Because it's always, all the interviews have just been people talking to him. Yeah. <laughs> Is this a dark picture? No. FBI. But that'll be Monday again. Yeah. I suppose you can take a picture of the folder, the binder down there. Like. What, that one on the. The one on the desk. That looks like it's got mold on it. Oh, there is. Actually, yeah, just take a picture of it. Class it was classified. We'll go to prison for this now. <laughs> Classified's fine. It's not like. Secret classified. Or top this is secret. classified level two. That not even just regular classified. That doesn't mean it doesn't mean shit. It's fine. You're not. You won't get into trouble for that. Like we're gonna end up in prison with fucking H. H. Holmes pretender. It's your they're cellmate. Gonna, they're gonna put us in the same cell. Oh, that would be that would be bad luck. That'd convicted, be... convicted on the same day. Oh, confidential. What are you doing, Tom? Don't <laughs> look at it. It says well, confidential. We're already going to prison. Psychological assessment conducted by Dr. Isabella Garcia. Patient name, Monday, Hector. Behavioral observation. Hector arrived at our scheduled appointment 24 minutes late. Psychopath. Once we sat down and began the session, he struggled to maintain eye contact. He found it difficult to articulate his feelings and was terse and guarded throughout. Ooh. Hector has been working long hours and, as a result, isn't sleeping well. Hector spoke about his recently deceased mother and displayed evidence that he hasn't yet fully come to terms with her death. Mm. I strongly recommended a course of antidepressants, but he is resistant to this idea, believing that it would have a detrimental effect on his capability with regards to his current investigation. Hector describes his work in immaculate detail, and contrary to earlier in the session, his thought content Ooh. is both coherent and logical. He is displaying ah. an unhealthy obsession mm. with his work, mm -hmm. but his recent bereavement may be the underlying issue. Yeah. You know, he's had, you know, family tragedy and he's just focusing on his work completely. That's fine. I'm sure it didn't turn him into a psychopath somehow, but, you know, obsessed with serial killers and H.H. H. Holmes in particular. Yeah. We're going through the vent, Tom. How do you feel about that? Well... As long as it's not a mannequin-filled vent. I worry that one of the webs has just vibrated and the spider's like, oh, he's in the vent. Oh. Fuck me. We've got so many people all separated. Well, I guess we don't have that one girl now because you killed Aaron. her. Erin. Yeah. Fuck. Look for a way out. I don't really need the torch, but it makes me feel good. Just be careful of trapdoors, Tom. Just... I am far more diligent <laughs> with trapdoors than anyone else. Nice. Yo, I'm not some fucking lab rat here for your amusement. No, I don't know. I think we might be. Also, is, there's got to be more than one, surely. How can they be keeping track of us upstairs and people downstairs? If we're all in different locations, no way one person can do all of that. He's so good at his job, and he's got sensors and stuff everywhere, so he knows every movement. No, I reckon there could be... Because that's, that's the other good thing about having 
a masked person. Yeah. It could if be we're not going to have the grand reveal of there being a fucking down here, man! Uh, like, scream! Spoiler. Yeah. There were two of them. Uh, but suddenly revealing there's actually two is the only other, like... So now what? The good trick. Yeah. With just a similar build and facial hair. Oh. oh. Okay. What? Okay, this is this is fine. <laughs> oh. For the last time, do not pull the main switch until we get someone out to replace the faulty wall, Laura. Shocking. Is that good? Shocking? Is that a good achievement to have? But is that... If that breaks all of the doors... There we go. Is that good? Well, it's dark, but we can now... Unless this is just all part of his plan. Oh, God. This stage, it's hard to know. What is, what is the plan and what isn't the plan? Uh... Why has she got to turn the torch off? Are you off? fucking kidding me? Is this her room? Someone has trashed her room? Oh god, I didn't like that. Oh! The lips balms. Oh, it's going to remind me of Erin. You were going to share lip cooties with her. Well, not anymore. I guess you can't take no, it just automatically does yeah. take it if you can. It didn't have another button choice. So this is kind of what he would do to fuck with you, right? What the hell? Oh, are they like what? Identical rooms? I don't really understand what she's so baffled about at the moment. Because these are their rooms. So this is Dead girl's room, right? Maybe. Oh, oh yeah. good coins. Nice. I'm glad that they have like a, a shared, uh, you know, treasury between all of them. <laughs> yeah. They're, they're, there's a good honor system. Okay, now we discover that it's a two way mirror, right? With a little catch on it. Like it's some kind of <gasps> door. Screwdriver. Have I always... Was I given that before? To be used as... I... <laughs> oh, what the hell? Okay. You might have to hide. Oh, don't oh, say that. That makes me real... I'm sorry. Real moody and tense. Oh, a picture. God, we've not had one of these for so long. I feel like we must have missed a couple. Can we have one? Right. Squeezing got, between got crushed. walls bad. We got crushed by something. And it looks like the girl was like, oh! So we... Maybe somehow interacted that and caused it to happen. Take the camera. Beep. Jesus, there's cameras everywhere. Sag. Sad. Beep. <laughs> okay. No, oh, you don't want to waste the battery, do you? Mark! Mark. Uh, I kind of feel like, you know, maybe as you're walking around to this place and you're seeing all of this, like, random shit, maybe, uh, start unplugging stuff at random. <laughs> oh, it's a mirror, right. Oh, I hate that. It's got the scarlet rot on it, Tom. That's an Elden Ring. It's an Elden Ring. 
You did an Elden Ring, Simon. Congratulations. Thank you. Do I get any good boy points? Yep. Uh, Woo! Oh! This is the bit from the trailer! Oh! Wow! Oh! oh. Wait, how, how did she not see him? You want to know what it means to be a killer? You ever been to the art museum downtown? Look at yes. this painting by a guy, I forget his name. Famous painter. Some fucking Goya. In portraits of slaughtered cows oh. hanging on hooks. You take a normal person to a slaughterhouse, and they will puke their guts out. You make it into a painting, and suddenly it's art. There's no difference between the two. No, not really. Don't look at me like that. You know I'm right. You get it. I know you get it. You got to do something that matters. Make people feel something they've never felt before. Shatter the illusion that any of us are really in control. Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful thing you've ever created. Tiggy diggy holes. And I promise you, it's <laughs> nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. Oh, okay. yes, Simon. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. To hear them pleading. Begging. Erection check. No, <laughs> good. We're fine. We're fine. It's always good to check them again. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. That's what you have to be. An artist. A sculptor. An architect. I see the gleam in your eye, Agent Monday. You're not fooling me. Look! Oh, look at you now, huh? Am I gonna be your first? Well, come on, then. Huh? I'm right here. This room is soundproof. You don't even have to wait for a plane to fly overhead. Oh. There you are. I see you now. Oh, not bad. Not bad at all. Bare hands can feel good, huh? But the blade makes for such a prettier picture. Uh, you've got potential, Agent Monday. If you truly want to be an artist. Oh. Okay. There's two of them. And one is the murderer guy. And the other is Agent Monday. Together. There wasn't like a quick time event immediately after. Oh god, the yeah, that's how they get you. Come on. Okay. Ah. Now, be careful shimmying between the walls because the power oh. will just come back on. Fuck, and you're right. We're gonna do a death. thing. Let's watch that premonition again. So, is it like she, if you have the option to press the button, maybe? We'll get crushed. So little context for it. I couldn't even see like the wallpaper on the walls or anything. Oh god. 
I, I don't want to miss a coin. <laughs> I want to buy the gun. I can't wait till I can shoot Agent Mundy. Bless or maybe my the other guy. Oh, I don't know if there is two. The guy just gets around because he knows all the shortcuts around the place. So he just flip from person to person. Keep Maybe. controlled in their little warrens. And like, when he's ready for them to do the next bit, he unlocks the thing. But if he was downstairs, fucking around with mannequins, but also up here, like, l listening to... What? Oh, I thought I had a... Beep. Do an interact. Oh, oh, the book I threw earlier, the the how to keep your brain. Oh book. right. Okay. Well, if that if the doors can't crush a crush a book, that's a good point. I'm pretty sure a body it is fine. Help books don't work. Da 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 da. <laughs> Sorry, I haven't done that in a while. <laughs> Literal days. Oh shit! I'm scratching my head. Three of you are out of their fucking roots. That is going to mess with him. If only he had someone to help him. Hmm. I guess you could stop moving furniture around. Yeah, blocking all the walls. With just bits of, you know, leave tables. just random shit. Yeah, because there's a lot frames. of a lot of furniture. Yeah, because a picture frame is probably about as tough as a book. I mean, you think so. Oh, God. Look through the creepy hole. Hello? There's no way that goes wrong. Hello? Ugh. Can you hear me? God, I hate it. It's not person, it's a recording, for fuck's sake. Can it, how can you not tell? Yeah, yeah, but I'm just waiting for the. You work with like mannequin head, audio visual shit. Like, how how do you not how do you not know that's a recording? Well, they're not they're not a great crew, are they? No, they're not. They're not doing well. This seems nice. Why are you... Why are you crying? I just get spooky. Spooky scared. Okay. Like, yeah. Just smash smash that mirror. Straight away. In case you missed me, Michelle. Uh, morning. Uh, requested to use the library or the music lounge, so assume I'm one of those. Can we dine outside in the garden? The bar seems to be a good writing spot. Dinner. Okay. Okay. Maybe that's Morello. Who's... Oh. Manny Sherman, the beast Morella. of Arkansas. Please, Morella. Morella. <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> I was like, maybe it's the writer. <gasps> that okay. wasn't met on the ferry. It, wait, it wasn't him on the... Yeah. He isn't Dumet? It wasn't the architect Dumet. It was the fucking writer, Morello. What? They're not the same? Well, we, we didn't... What? <laughs> we knew Jumet wasn't the owner, right? But this is a this is a reveal that Jumet is the writer. Well, Morello's the writer. The guy yeah. that we thought was Dumet is Morello. There is no Jumet, maybe. Well, there was at some point, probably. Uh, but honestly, I was glad to be leaving. Uh, they'd be nice folks, the stewards, real nice. Both in their 70s now. Dad's still strong as an ox, being a military man before moving to the town to settle and start a family. Mom was starting to get a little frail. You could tell uh, she had taken it the hardest. Mrs. Stewart had made me coffee. She was functioning okay, but had a dead behind the eyes look. 26 years on, still living in that cocoon of numbness such devastation can bring. Oh, oh fuck. I didn't, mean, I, didn't mean, I didn't mean to do that. Fucked up. We talked a lot. Uh, they were at ease talking about anything. 
The night that it happened, the cruel details, how they felt about him. It was just a fact of life to them. The daughter had been murdered by a serial killer. Oh. And that was their world. That sounds really mean. Maybe use kind of words. Uh, I don't like the cocoon sentence. Uh, is there a more relatable metaphor? Everything. Uh, it was a shock when they offered me uh, off to show me Mary's room. I was apprehensive, but thanked them and agreed. Uh, I would be, it would be helpful to get an idea of what kind of a girl Mary was. I followed Mrs. Stewart. I could feel the toll that the murderer had taken as we walked through the house and upstairs to Mary's room. Her husband didn't like to go into that room. Things were neat and tidy, but shabby. We walked over a beaten old carpet, past outdated wallpaper and paintings, mostly biblical, uh, that were thick with dust. The strain and financial impact must have been huge. Mrs. Stewart hadn't worked since Mary's death. Again, sounds really mean. Can you not say that they had a rough time of it without being so descriptive? Maybe explain why. Did you find it difficult to face anyone? Oh, fuck, I didn't turn the page. God, I'm just bad at it. It feels like, I don't know. Maybe his wife was his editor, leaving notes, reading through his, um, oh, his the... draft. Her schoolwork was stacked uh, by her bed, and her childhood toys and dolls were still displayed on the shelves. What stuck out most, though, was her uniform, still hanging in front of the wardrobe, Ugh. ready for a shift at the diner the next day. Mary was a tiny girl, only 5'1", and weighed less than 100 pounds. She didn't stand a chance that night she was taken. Kept thinking about her room as I drove through town. Milton uh, would have been an unremarkable place in 1995, but it was close to lifeless now. Oh, it's Michigan hell. for you. It's just fine. This is a good part of the game to press the wrong button. Yeah. <laughs> uh, mostly boarded up uh, buildings. The only uh, open shops were liquor stores, which had bums outside them, drinking at 11 a.m. It was as if the town had died when Mary did. Eventually, Milton faded into my real rearview mirror as an image, uh, as the image of Mary's uniform burned into my mind. Uh, go hug Natalie right now, please. Oh. Uh, later the next day, I finally got back to our house, scrambled over a package, uh, sat on our doorsteps, a brown box. I had no idea who it was from. Had Michelle ordered something? Curiosity took over, and I hauled it outside, opening it. I found an old tape recorder along with a quartet of tapes. I listened to the first one, the voice, unmistakable. It was Sherman. Uh, no mention. Uh, nope. Mention the interviews. The note is, Michelle ordered something? Nope. Oh. You see, they, right, okay. they're they just in the wrong place. On the, okay. But that's fine. So, you so got Monday... The psychopath who actually invites Morello to this place left the package of his interviews with Sherman right. at Morello's house. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Mama! Don't do that. Mama! Bethany. 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 Is it property of Bethany Morello or is it just a doll that's called Bethany? I can't remember any of their names. Yeah, it's the... The daughter, Bethany. Just smash a window and jump out. Oh! Um, that don't look great, does that it? That looks bad. Bethany's sad. Please stop crying, Mommy. Please stop crying, Mommy. What did happen to mommy? Because. Beast body burgled! Uh, Arkansas, this week, the body of the so called Beast of Arkansas has been removed from its grave by suspected body snatchers. Oh, well, he's not alive. The infamous serial killer, whose real name is Manny Sherman, uh, was executed earlier this month, and his remains were buried at an undisclosed cemetery in Springdale. Uh, Arkansas? Sure, Arizona? Yeah. No, that's what he said. Uh, a senior police spokesperson for the local law enforcement stated at a press conference, We believe this to be the work of a serial killer obsessives and are pursuing various leads. 
we assume there's multiple suspects involved, but we have not ruled out that it might be an individual. Great, great work. Although the barrel site is unknown, rumors have been circulating among serial killer enthusiast forums online since Sherman's execution. When questioned by the press about such online groups, the spokesperson added, These people are, who call themselves fans of serial killers are very foolish. If they're aware of the despicable details of such crimes, as we are, uh, as we in law enforcement are, they would rethink their views about celebrating such heinous criminals. Police refused to confirm the name of the cemetery to the media in the aftermath of the news. Okay. I'm guessing the body's probably here somewhere. Connie. They made the girl drink from a bowl. Well, maybe it's a dog. They brought their dog with them. <gasps> Is it like Silas the dog boy? But it's drafts. Connie the cat girl. <laughs> uh, okay, they loved playing drafts. Man, like they had to order like a big bump of box of drafts, didn't they? Focus. Well, we don't have a code, do we? We need to find a code in the room. Mm. I'm guessing the door won't open, but we may as well try it. No, sir. Oh. Oh, yeah. That's that's what we've literally just read. Well, look, there's... I don't think there's numbers on there. No. Like, we're really smart. Yeah. We wouldn't have missed a number. We wouldn't have. Okay, there's two boats. Two boats. Three blood splats. Three blood splats. Uh, one book. One and book. And then three bits of broken cup. Three bits of broken cup. That was the mummy. Mummy, please stop crying. Oh, mummy. Mama. Why are you crying? Okay, there's the book with the notes on. In. Never that there's a date or something in them. Or... Oh, do we just have to. Oh. Oh, oh that was just Eight, the. 8259. Yeah, honestly, not terrible. Seems wild, but. Well, not really, because it's four numbers. But, uh. Like, just why would mechanically that be the code like in an escape room type system i can see why yeah but why would you change the code to being people's meeting thing eight two five nine oh I, okay. I think your logic was impeccable yeah you know we're just too smart for our own good simon too smart for our own good uh okay well we can actually leave this room we're not Trapped in here. I think it's in the room. We've got to find the thing in the room, I think. What about the book again? Well, I think we can go further down the corridor, can't we? Oh, no, we can't. Does she have a number on her head? <laughs> it would be surprising. I would say it's worth a look, but I honestly didn't think it was worth a look. A number on her head. <laughs> but. Kay can use her pencil. Are you fucking kidding me? To find out what was okay. written on torn paper? Oh, okay. Well, apparently this is a, a brand new mechanic. Okay. Where you can do the old scribbly boy. No, you've got to do it like at an angle. You don't... Okay. 1999. Okay. Well, how, That's really how did dumb. you not work? How did you not work? <laughs> that, so? How did I not What's know that? What's wrong with you? You're meant to be the, the smart boy. Uh, did that message appear earlier? And we I missed don't it? think so. I would feel like we were. Oh god. Nice. Oh god! Prepare for spooky jump scare. Oh fuck me! <laughs> oh. Here we go. Oh, they're fighting over a gun. Well, that fucking didn't help at all. Dragged. Oh, that's the gun we could, we're gonna buy. Oh my god, should we watch that again? Just to see if there's like... <sighs> it was the one with the vertebrae. 
is being dragged. So they're outside, right? On, on a the, boat. On the boat or on the dock. Does not really yeah. give the most information on how does how that we're... help us make the right decision? This is this isn't gonna be good. This isn't gonna be good, Tom. This isn't gonna be good. Oh, fuck me. You ready? It's actually her body, isn't it? Her eyes gonna pop out. Oh, even worse. Oh, she has no eyes to pop out. Found a secret, Tom. The Mrs. Morello animatronic. Charlie? Charlie, my boy. So, shouldn't there be a burnt body in here? The jacket. Huh. Oh. Sure. Well, I guess I'll just leave the door open. I wouldn't even say he was burned. Nah, he seems fine, doesn't he? It's because he's a cockney. Can't burn them. What did you get? Phoenix. Phoenix. Nice. Oh, rising from the ashes. Mm -hmm.